my 20s, and I was walking down the street in the Upper East Side where my parents were now living, and I bumped into my mother walking down the street, and it was like meeting a stranger. I said, hi, Mom, and my friend was so shocked by the, the way we greeted each other. It was kind of, and we sort of exchanged pleasantries the way you would with a stranger, and then my mother went on, and my friend said, I never would have guessed that that was your mother. And I wondered where she'd been, of course, because immediately I wondered, was she coming from a bar? Was she right, never, right, right. you know? There's always that strange feeling. And there's something interesting that she said to you on her deathbed. Oh yeah, this was this is so mean. It was hard for me to write it because it was so mean. I, I thought this is the cruelest thing I've ever. I know. <laughs> well, you remember the adventurous crocheter, um, which is such an important book in my life, I guess, and. Um, we, when I was getting divorced and my husband was telling me he didn't want me to leave, I recited that book to myself in my head, and as a result, I know it by heart. There is no wrong way to crochet. There are easier ways and harder ways. But any, I mean, I know this book. I, I can recite it like I can recite the Gettysburg Address, mm -hmm. which I can also recite. But OK, <laughs> the book was about to come out. And I was, at my, I was with my mother in the hospital, and I didn't know what to talk to her about, and I brought up this fact that, just, I don't know why, that um, when she went to Hunter College, she used to take everyone's swim test, because nobody knew how to swim at Hunter, because they, they were all residents of New York, and they never knew how to swim. So she would take their swim test, and, and they would, in return, take her math tests, okay? <laughs> So I don't know why we love this family, uh, this story. It's like a story about cheating, but we all thought it was so cute. But right. anyway, I brought it up, and my mother said, I didn't hate math. I hated crocheting. And I thought, oh my god. I, I thought when I, when I wrote this, I thought, did my mother hate me? Right. You know, and then I thought, god, I was such a cutie. Right. <laughs> but she really and a good hated kid. Me, you know, yeah and, yeah, and a good kid. I never, except for converting to Christianity by That's, accident I love twice, that. I was a very good kid. You gotta tell, you gotta tell those. <laughs> um, and it was really a shocking moment yeah. in my life, I gotta say. And, and Do you think that, that she treated you differently than your sisters? Or did they I all feel I think she the same thought way? that I was my father's, Favorite. that I sided with my father and that, and that. She was, I, I think so, but you know, her brain was at a, I, you know, I, it's one of those things. I right. don't know, my, my friend Susan went to visit her in the hospital, which she didn't even tell me, and my mother said to her, bring me a bottle of Chivas. So there you have it, take notes. I hated crocheting, bring me a bottle of Chivas. Wow. Three final lines. <laughs>